Do you know Nuba? Like, I know Nuba. I'm on sales, Tony Sales. Reed Cabral. David Bowie. And what is this? Well, we're Tim Machine. And this is... And we're on Nuba. Met for the first time over 10 years ago. We met David um, years ago at this nightclub called Fifi's Leather Bar. <laughs> um, and, uh, Tim Machine in a little bit, but first some news. Tom Petty and the Heartbreak. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Tom Petty in the heart. I mean, in a small situation, you can read, you can actually see your audience. You know, you can, you can, you can read them more quickly and more easily, and they, you can also when memorize they're, when they're, their phone numbers. When they're when they're, <laughs> when they're vocal about something that you do, I mean, when they yell at you, when somebody when at the they back yell at yells, you, you, you can, you yell can back. hear it. You can hear it. You can find them. You can go out after them. I mean, it's, it's the, the, the just the interplay you in general. You can find them, go out after them, and thump them. It sounds more like a studio album than the former one. Uh, you, you have more time in the studio well, the to make this one. The album was done in a field. <laughs> done in a field. The first album we did in a field. With a small tape recorder. No, a small field. Mm -hmm. Big tape recorder. But is that true? You spend more time in the studio or not? Only more time in the field. We only spend How are you all getting on? Is it all working out all right, Tin Machine? We have color problems. Yeah, just... <laughs> I, thought time, was, I thought it was just me. I thought it was... Time, his jack and I have to keep these on. I yeah. It's... I didn't want to do it at all. I got dragged into this. In fact, they've got stuff on me from my past that I'd rather not talk about, and they threatened to reveal it if I didn't stay with the band. So I'm doing this under duress. Did, how, how did you like the tour? Was it nice? Was it nice? Yeah, uh, did, did you, you like doing the tour? Um, while, while we were rehearsing. How much popcorn did you eat? <laughs> about 10 pounds worth. <laughs> <laughs> how did you all meet? Tell me about that Switzerland affair it, well actually we were in brazil it oh, was really? a dark and stormy evening mm -hmm. and uh, we all have the same plastic surgeon down there <laughs> and and we, it just seemed like the right thing to do at the time okay ask me the questions i'll see i've got an answer for them in this <laughs> what's the first one the first question is yes was it really as far back as 77 when you first met further further yeah 1973 <laughs> Yeah. You have a long experience as a solo artist. Yes, I do. And I, oh, are you talking, to you? <laughs> David? And uh, how, do, how do you like you know working with a band? Is it difficult? I, it's Isn't fantastic. It a step back. You, you hate Love it. Love it. <laughs> how much do I owe you for saying that? Okay, uh, <laughs> I endure it. What do you What do you think about playing in Cleveland? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry? Are you okay? <laughs> um, what do you think about being hospitalized in Cleveland? Um, what, do you, what do you think about playing in the Agora? It's a small venue. It's back in a I'm hospital. disappointed that it's not the Agora that I knew and loved in 1973, because apparently that one was burnt down. Yeah, uh, it so, burned down. Yeah. I didn't mean... It was these things. I just didn't mean to, but it was... It asked to be torched. Uh, you will play guitar with anything. Uh, <laughs> you say that again. <laughs> I mean, really? Yes. <laughs> I mean, electric razors, marital aids. Um, I never thought of it as a marital aid. I can't, we, none of us can think of it anymore as a marital aid. For us, it's a musical instrument. Yeah. Why don't, let's let them in on this. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's a vibrator. But you've got to understand that the, that the funniest aspect of it, when he wanted a sound that made the strings of the guitar buzz, and so we decided the vibration thing of a vibrate. So he went around all the sex shops in Sydney where we were recording, asking them for different from lady fingers up to double dongs or whatever it is. <laughs> and actually holding them up, holding them up to his ear. And he was in one shop, and there was a guy with a vacuum cleaner vacuuming up, and Re Reeves goes... And the guy goes, no! It's true! You have to suffer for your You should have been there. That's right. They have opinions. <laughs> so, you know, I mean, you know, that's not exactly easy to deal with. So how are things but working? But you have definitely humbled yourself to... Yes, I'm probably a much, much better, nicer person now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, you, you'll stick to small clubs in the future as well, or...? Large clubs, small audiences. 
Large clubs, small <laughs> <laughs> by choice. Just talk. Yeah, a little, little odd. Yeah, okay. We're, we're, we're talking about audience. between two and happy. four thousand people on, the, on this come, upcoming happy tour people. in October. We're yeah. happy, shiny people. Mm -hmm. Nobody has the final decision. Nobody says, "Okay, that's it." This is got, there's some big egos in this band, you know. But uh, speak yourself. Actually, I was. But <laughs> no, there, there are, there's uh, there's some strong personalities in the group, you know. But big we, egos is much better. But we. Uh, I have a strong personality. They have big egos. Mm -hmm. for you to do, go in another direction. Hello, Ron. <laughs> just just a mate of ours in Dublin. Yeah. Yes, I have a few mates in Dublin as well. <laughs> yeah, left a long time ago. <laughs> yeah. Let's take a look at this. Well, why, why do you think your shop owners will have problems with this? What, they, what's the the hair they didn't like the hair. <laughs> <laughs> they said they looked uh, sort of out of date, unfashionable hairstyles. Yeah, well, you worked out for this, but who, who's David, So we had by to the cut way? their heads off. Reese, who's, who's David? This is David. That's Hunt. No, that, yeah, that's Hunt. That's David. That's me, and that's Tony. How do you, how do you know? By the way, you, you like shower together? Well, it's hear. obvious. Uh, turn it around. Turn it the back. Turn around. Turn, turn around. Turn around. Ooh. Ooh. They say it's, it's a, a dummy. It's <laughs> a, no, it's equal. <laughs> Theater. Well, the budget of this show. What is the biggest special effect you do on stage? The cigarette lighters that, that the crew gives us to light our cigarettes. Okay, well, right, wouldn't you say? I just want to put it in your boxer shorts. My <laughs> boxer shorts, yeah. <laughs> um, boy, are they especially fat. <laughs> yeah, I'd like to say this, this psychiatrist, yeah. he's walking down New York Street, right? Yeah. And he gets run over by a car, he's yeah. dead. Yeah. So he's on his way up to heaven. Yeah. St. Peter's there at the gate and he says, oh, we're expecting you. He says, you are. I just want to go through on the heaven. You'll go through, but we have a problem here. We may need you. He says, yes. He says, it's about God. And he says, yes, God has a problem. He says, well, what's God's problem? God, he thinks he's David Bowie. Wow. <laughs> what a funny way to end it, you know. Mm -hmm. um, the... Um, yeah. There's something going on here. Um, it's a Charlie McCarthy routine. Sorry, you know, I like drinking water, but I couldn't think. But I... Anyway. Now, the reason the name is Tin Machine uh, yeah. is Helen Hayes was already used. <laughs> There's absolutely no reasoning behind it whatsoever. It's just that you need a name, so that's a name. It really didn't bother But we us. did do a fair amount of rationalizing after the fact. If you want Such to as what? Uh, well, the fact it sounded that like Iron Butterfly, and yes, it was like a puny the, Iron Butterfly. Yeah, or it was tin, which is kind of like a, the a worst kind of metal. metal. <laughs> the worst kind of metal available in machine, just implied. I don't even know these guys. <laughs> Parker and, and Dizzy and all those cats. I, I like those guys. Charlie's a great singer, too. Yeah. Or Ned Feldman. Or Ned Feldman was. <laughs> okay. Okay. Stop. Now we got to talk about something serious. This is very serious. Right. Uh, I'm being serious. Serious stuff. <laughs> Shopping for girls. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um. Thank you. Thank you. We've been wanting to do that for a long time. Think about the song One Shot. It's a latter day Frank, Frankie and Johnny. I think in this particular story that the guy just didn't see any other way out and, and it, I think it was uh, a thing done on the spur of the moment. Will you still respect me in the morning? Uh, that's, that's the, I, I don't know. that's I don't what it's all about. <laughs> that's, that's my goal. Some rumors you were doing an album with uh, Nile Rogers or had plans for that? Is yeah, that uh, oh, you mean that? That was a rumor. Yeah? A rumor? <laughs> smoke gets in. Maybe you should try to smoke through your nose and it, like... I saw Nile last year. Mm -hmm. It's very well, thank you. Okay, well, that's I good to hear. I never miss Nile. You never do. I never see him, so I don't miss him. It's not the circus. It's not the uh, uh, spectacle. If you want that, that's Madonna, Michael Jackson, and his last tour. <laughs> <laughs> this ain't a Bowie thing. This is Tin Machine. And what was that? Oh, I see. It's the Bowie's dead machine lid. You, you'll notice on that none of us have any clothes on. I think it's because I'm donating my wardrobe to medicine. <laughs> uh, for tra transplants for fashion victims. You know, what made you decide? 30 Should guilders. It? Only 30 guilders? Well, I'll, I'll pay somewhere. more for that. You know what, maybe I, you I'd got, like maybe you guys could, that Yeah, guitar. maybe you guys could sign it spontaneously. Absolutely. Do you have a spontaneous plan? Well, I thought Reeves had a big gold marker in his, in his pocket. No, I was looking for this. Here's okay. a marker now. 
En while you sign it, uh, dan kan ik alvast wat even vertellen over de, over de veiling. Dat is het volgende. We hebben een basgitaar van, uh, van Mark King van Level 42. Ook hebben we een stage jack van Mick Jagger. Dus uh, als je erbij wilt zijn, dan moet je gewoon even schrijven naar het volgende adres. Dat is Postbus 1122 1200 BC. In Hilversum. Ja. Nou, gaan we eens even kijken of de heren hem... Uh, would you sign it, please? We do, we get on. We, we get on. As well as... Well as um, not that well. We get on... Uh, we get on quite well. We have a lot of... I'm ladies see that. There's enough tension in this band to keep it interesting. About the album. This, yeah, this, yeah, this, yeah. Bring it up. It's coming to Christmas, and as you know, we're a very low-budget band, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. You yeah. do know that. You do appreciate <laughs> that. I mean, I, I can tell that by the fee that we get when we do TV oh, shows. Oh, out, out, uh, David, out. We've given you a little Christmas present that we thought you'd appreciate. Oh. <laughs> you know? <laughs> Did you see that? Let's, let's discuss this for a minute because... Let's discuss this for a minute, on shall we? The, <laughs> on the album, yes. there are fig leaves covering But no, the... they rip them off. They, um, the, the <laughs> genitalia. I don't know... Now, that's your... Oh! Don't, <laughs> I don't know here. what's under... It's a, it's a slap thing. Yeah, I feel like I'm home. <laughs> <laughs> oh, see, this is not... The one well, I've seen. Uh, which one, what have we got here? See, oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. See, this is the one with the real penises. This is that's it. That's the one. one. That's the one. That, you, you can show that if you like. Yeah, well, I don't know if we can, but man. It's sort of, yeah, hey, kind of hey, like hey, that, hey, hey, but they're, um, <laughs> but they're smaller and white. <laughs> <laughs> But we thought we'd give you this for you uh, for your celebratory days before and after Christmas. I'll take it. Uh... We are the little model of the Kuros in this German egg company, the Kinder toy, mm -hmm. in the toy. So you can get a little Kuros that you can assemble at home. You might have to write in for the missing piece. Are you the leader in your group? Yes, quite definitely. Oh. I am the leader. Are you? You are the bossy right? yeah. We'll do anything for you. I would come all day I would swim the ocean blue I would walk a thousand miles Reveal my secrets I'm more than enough for me to share I would grow roses around my door Sit in the garden we're going to take a quick break right now. We'll be right back with Ice-T, Jazzy Jeff, and the Fresh Prince, and a big noise on the L.A. scene these days, L7, so don't go away.